Hello, Beret Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beret Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day, girl. I don't know if you have been watching my other videos or not, but you know, I'm just relying on these videos to keep me positive and nice because I have not been having the best day ever you know like a lot of shit is happening uh, at, in, on a professional level nothing related to the channel you know or this community just my other jobs and um yeah definitely not in a good space but i think the only thing that really kind of like put me in a better mood is just to come here and spill the tea and talk to you guys and um yes just living life so let's talk about summer house because shit is going definitely down between Lindsay Hubbard and Carl Radke and I think we definitely need to talk about it right so girl second weekend with Carl and Lindsay and those two are going so hard after each other you know but especially Lindsay is just not not stopping of trying to say, you know, trying to put out there that Carl Radke is definitely not being sober anymore, you know. And I think it's quite interesting how, you know, people are reacting, you know. Look, I like Carl. You know, but I also like Lindsay. And I feel a lot of people say like, oh, this is Lindsay being drunk, you know, just because she's drunk then she can blame whatever she wants to call. Um, that might be true, but also I feel that we need to understand that people who has got, who are into like addictions, you know, they can play people out. You know, it, it, it could get like very nasty because they know, I mean, if you have had addicts in your family, you might be able to understand this a little bit more. I had some and I have gone through like those things of when someone that is an addict is lying about using, you know, and it's hard, you know, that shit is hard, you know, and I think it, it like getting that trust once is getting is, is is it got lost is a little bit complicated you know but i'm not saying i don't know like we are not there the only thing that i do know is that Lindsay has known carl on drugs we have never actually seen a carl on drugs we have seen carl you know on tv when he was drinking and stuff and we are su supposing that is that even a war supposing I don't know. We are, we think, Latino moment, guys. We think that that's a car on drugs, you know? But we don't have not really know, like, oh, remember that party or remember when he did that? That time he was definitely on, the, on, on drugs. We have never seen that, you know? While Lindsay has been and has a recollection of that memory, you know? Again, I'm not saying that she's right, but I think it's important to understand that she knows the difference between a Carl under the influence and a sober Carl. You know what I mean? That's why I don't want to jump so far into just hating Lindsay. A lot of people are, are hating Lindsay just because they are have been haters from a long time ago, you know, and they think that everything that she says or do is immediately wrong. I think, we don't know, maybe she saw something in there. Maybe there is a reason why she believes that she, that Carl is under the influence or some, of something, you know? So only time will tell. I don't know, you know? Only time will tell uh, that when eventually one of them admits to being wrong, you know? But so far we have not heard, like really heard Lindsay saying, you know what? I, I I take it back, you know, I don't think that he was actually on drugs. We have not seen that, which is quite interesting to be very honest with you. Now, um, one of the things that people are talking right now is that Carl, you know, after breaking up the engagement, 
he is asking for the ring back. And a lot of people are having different opinions about this, you know? A lot of people are saying like, oh no, uh, she she needs to give the ring back, you know? A lot of people are saying like, why does she have to give the ring back, you know? I think it all comes down to the fact that Carl feels that, you know, it was the engagement didn't went through, you know, and that it was a lot of money, you know, and that he's entitled to have the ring back. And that might be true, but in my opinion, that might be true if she wouldn't have been the one to break up the engagement. But in this case, she's the one who is being deceived. You know, like she's the one who would thought that they were going to get married and he's the one breaking up the engagement, you know. So maybe she doesn't have to give the ring back. I don't know, you know. Uh, now, Carl says that she that he sent a letter to Lindsay because he's just following New York law. Because according to New York law, um, the ring was property of Carl because he was the one who bought the ring and he gave the ring to her you know under the promise of the engagement of getting married and because the promise did not happen then the law says that she needs to give him the ring back I'm not a lawyer I'm not a lawyer in New York I have no idea how that will work you know but if he wants to go legal I think it's going to be like a little bit of a problem for everyone. And I'm saying like, girl, again, you were the one who broke the engagement. You were the one who said, I don't want to marry you anymore. You were the one who called the cameras and the producers to tell in front of the cameras, I am not going to be marrying you for whatever reason it is. So now how is he going to defend that? How is he going to say like, oh, you know, I'm entitled to get the ring back when he was the one who doesn't want to get married because Lindsay was very much ready to get ready, you know? So I'm a little bit everywhere right now, you know, I'm, I'm waiting to see. I, I don't think we should be on teams. I think there is a lot of things that need to be discussed, you know? And I don't think we should be placing blames just yet. Um, we need to keep watching the show and trying to understand, you know, and, and wait and see. So let me know what you guys think on uh, the comments below. Do you think that car? I'm sorry, that Lindsay should return the, the ring, or what do you think it needs to happen? All right. Let me know, and if you're gonna get all the tea related to Summer House or any of the other Bravo shows, make sure to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.